Ooh, it's dark. What's going on, guys? It's Critical Failure. It's Friday night. I'm hanging out. Got something I want to show you. Now, I'm using camera on screen, primitive recording, because I want to show you this without any hindering from the uh, pr recording software. So if you check this out, this is running Linux. And when you play Counter-Strike Global Offensive on Linux, it can do something that the Steam version cannot do. And I think this is worth checking out. All right, so this is just a simple little thing, but it's going to make me want to play this game exclusively on Linux now. Check this out. All right, I'm in a multiplayer deathmatch game. Watch me alt-tab out using Linux. Immediate alt-tab out. Look at that. Right? Immediately back in. And it's working. I can click around. It's fine. Immediate alt-tab out. Immediately back in. So now we're in Windows 7. Take a look at how badly Windows 7 handles the alt tabbing out of Counter-Strike Global Offensive mid-match. Alright, so you ready for this? Watch how long it takes to alt tab out and back in again. Alt tab out, alright. Oh, look at it drag. Oh, come on, let me back in. Oh, finally we're back in. Oh. Whew, surprised we made it. Alright, let's try that one more time. I'm surprised it's jumping out that fast. And then we can jump right back in. Oh, oh, watch it drag its feet. My goodness. My goodness. This is a simple alt tab out and back in again. Whew. I feel like I have to play this on Linux now because I have to be able to do that if, um, if I don't want to quit a competitive match, but it's just too unbearable to play. <laughs> 